Hey there, Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Always appreciate when you watch what we do as we head to Costco in Hawaii. Uh, we already went to Costco once down in uh, Honolulu. This is a different Costco, but we want to go check out some of the different foods that they have. Not our normal Costco video. Before we get into that, though, love for you to hit the subscribe button below if you haven't already done so. Also, the bell notification button below. That'll get you notified when we put up future videos. Love for you to hit the like button, too, because that helps us out immensely. I know that uh, Andy found some cool stuff at that other Costco we went to, but we want to go in there and see what else they've got as far as food is concerned, because we're not going to really buy anything because we're in Hawaii. So let's go check out some food. We'll get parked and we'll go see what they've got in the way of food here at Costco. So hang tight. It really doesn't look much different than our Costco. No, it doesn't, but it is bigger. Huh? It is bigger. It is? It doesn't look, yeah, it's, it is bigger. I'd have to think about that. It may not be. What? It may not be bigger than ours. No, like I said, it doesn't look much different than our Costco is what I was saying. I do want to talk about this roasting pan because it's not on sale. It most likely will be on sale in the future. But this is what we use for our turkey prime rib. We've used this several times. This is a good pan. The uh, Circulon Oval Roaster with Rack. And honestly, the only thing I don't like about it is just not dishwasher safe because you have to hand wash it. Yeah, just keep that in mind, but it is a good roasting pan. And we are still waiting for the price of turkeys to come out. Uh, mm. Hopefully it will come out next week. Um, and we'll let you know what it is. But remember, we're here to look at who do we can't get in Indiana. Right. So let's go back here. And it was inside the coolers or something? Well, they have fresh produce over there. They have pies, they have cakes. They got a whole fresh produce section, but we have one too. Everybody's talking about the pineapple. In well, Costco. you are in Hawaii. Right, everybody was talking about that. Let's see if we can find pineapple here. Ooh, honey. Ooh, a guava cheesecake. I've never seen that. There you go, guava cheesecake, something different. 1999. Guava cheesecake. So we're looking for pineapples. Oh, here we go. Here. So we are driving, we actually drove by the Dole Pineapple Plantation. Mm -hmm. We didn't go in it, but these are actually from Dole. Yeah, 369 each for the pineapple. Did you want to grab one and actually try it? Yeah, we could. How do you pick a pineapple, though? Smell it. Smell if it's ripe enough. Ooh. Mmm. That smells good. That one smells really good. Okay. Everybody's yeah. talking about the pineapples. We are going to buy a pineapple. It's not really green, but most of these are not... They've got the yellow tint to them. Mm -hmm. so. And okay. they're local. So we're going to try one, fresh from Hawaii. We did get a pumpkin pie, the last Costco, the one down in uh, Waikiki, uh, down in Honolulu. And what happened was as we were walking to the, walking to the car, the uh, pumpkin pie flipped over and ruined so we're going to wait till we get back home before we get another one. But five ninety nine, they've had that same price for pumpkin pies for a couple of decades anyway. When we were here last time at Bob Pokey. How was the pokey? Oh, it was delicious. Yeah. Was it reasonably priced? It's about $20 for a thing of pokey, which I think is reasonable for about a fish you get. And pokey, I guess, is made fresh daily here every day. So here, like this poke bowl. That's, that's not pokey. Shrimp. That's shrimp. shrimp. It would be pokey's over here. Well, po pokey in general is just like. I wanted to see the price. It's seventeen dollars for a poke bowl there. So there is not spicy pokey, and there is spicy pokey. What if I ate this before the trip? Huh? What if I ate it before the trip? Is that what you want for lunch and eat it before the train? Kind of. 
you may want to get one slightly smaller in size. So there is a Chinese style chicken salad for $12.99, which we don't usually find in our... Actually, honey, you liked it. You may like this because it has those things that you like right there. Remember? Okay. For a long time, you've been trying to find it. Yeah, that's true. What's out here? So here is the different kinds. There is tofu. This is Kahlua pork. Just regular pork, but Kahlua pork. Twenty one ninety nine. They have kimchi. Kimchi. We actually did try the kimchi. We didn't buy this one. We bought actually this one. The Hamai's High Max Kimchi. There's shredded tagu. This is seafoods, butterfish, seaweed salad, pork lao lao, different kind of pork. There's uh, apparently a six count. Twenty one forty nine. Lomi sa uh, lomi salmon. Nine fifty nine. Pickled vegetables. Six sixty nine. What is this right here? Oh, this is just shredded pork. More pork. Yeah. 19.99. We did buy the bows. Uh, the right. bows are really good. Works out to be uh, a little over two bucks a bow, which is kind of what you're going to pay for them at a Chinese bakery. Or mild sausage, 8.39. What about aku sticks? 20.99 for aku. Portuguese sausage for 10.99. Mm -hmm. What is this? That is yakisoba. Oh, this is uh, stir fry noodles. Yeah. Right. That's only a six forty nine for that. They've got uh, what is that? Char siu pork. Right, char siu pork. Um, so that's going to be sixteen eighty nine for that. Rendo's sausage for mm -hmm. nine ninety nine. Mm -hmm. so and we did buy the fish cakes, but we didn't buy this many fish cakes. We bought like only one because right. there's four of them. We don't need four of them. We went and bought one from. Walmart. If you've not checked out our Walmart videos, here is the link to it. They do have ramen. Uh, they have a uh, shoyu ramen for twelve sixty nine, and then they have uh, shishim. Uh, this is six seventy nine for Sun Noodles Hawaii's original. Semi, uh, uh, I guess it's Saimin. That's how it's pronounced. But they have that here for six seventy nine. Here's another thing that they have here that's uh, local, I guess, to Hawaii. What is this? A uh, hang on, I got to read this. A KTM Enjoy Local Snacks Large Gift Basket. Um, a gift basket of local Hawaiian um, snacks for fourteen. I'm sorry, for forty nine ninety nine. So if you want to send that to somebody uh, for uh, Christmas, this is something you can pick up and give them a bunch of Hawaiian snacks. So we, there is fresh sushi here, which we don't have in our local Costco, and it's made daily. So this is the one we got last time, the 949, and it was really good 20 pieces. You interested in uh, sushi, Andy, or do you want to wait? I mean, I have the pokey. Oh, you have a pokey, so you didn't need yeah. to get sushi. Yeah. So sushi is less expensive than pokey, but... Yeah, but snow. that's like pure tuna. Well, we're going to do sushi tomorrow anyway, aren't we? Yeah. Right. So there is the Snow Fox Sushi Combo Deluxe for $12.99. There is the family platter for $36.99, the crunch roll, the crunch deluxe roll for $12.99. It's got $3 off, $3.90 off on it. The Mahalo's platter, snow sushi platter for $25.49. 10 pieces New York deluxe, $8.89. And the snow fox sushi mixed combo for $17.99. Fresh sushi. That's a lot of sushi for 36 bucks, though. It is. It's 50 pieces. We've gone through 50 pieces. Yes, you have. And we should do sushi on uh, the kids' birthdays because the kids love sushi on their birthdays. Andy usually gets it. Um, a couple other of my children gets it also. My second child does. Ooh, look at this. Shishimi trays for $17.99. I remember that we bought tuna that wasn't shishimi. And Andy ate it just because it was tuna. 
but sashimi is basically raw fish. Ooh, this one looks really good, Andy. What's that one? That's got uh, sashimi, which, what is it, tuna, and what else? It's sashimi it's, and... It's two different kinds of tuna. Right. Oh, two different kinds of tuna? Yeah. Comes with uh, chopsticks and wasabi if you're hungry. Yeah. But if you really want to make your own, you can buy the fresh tuna here. You just want to make sure you buy the sashimi grade tuna. Yeah. Or sashimi grade fish. Well, and you bought the you bought the salmon because you were going to cook the salmon. Right. But Andy didn't realize it wasn't sashimi grade salmon, so he ate it raw anyway. And guess what? He's still alive. Yeah, he's still alive. It was delicious. Wow! Look at that. I don't think we have that at our Costco. We do not have that one at our Costco. Oh, wild calamari steaks, five pound box for twenty bucks, nineteen ninety nine. They also have um, wild cooked red king crab legs and claws, a full case. You get uh, four to seven sized legs frozen, three hundred eighty nine bucks for that. Wow! But if you like crab, there you go. <laughs> These are birthday cakes. A uh, 10 inch white cake filled with vanilla cheesecake mousse, $15.99. I don't think we have these at our, uh, at our Costco I either. I've never seen birthday cakes or cakes with cheesecake mousse on it. Yeah, cheesecake mousse. Something different. Yeah. I do like mousse and I like cheesecake. But I still like my buttercream frosting. And normally I'd have the uh, Costco sign behind me. But as packed as this place was on a Tuesday, uh, there's really no place to park. So we're just going to sit here and wrap things up. Only picked up a couple of things like a pineapple. Uh, and Andy got uh, what, sashimi? He got uh, pokey. Pokey. So he got a pokey bowl and uh, we got a couple of things. We've only got a couple more days here, so we didn't want to buy a lot. But we wanted you to see the different types of food that they have at uh, in Hawaii. Uh, at Costco. So thanks for watching. Appreciate you checking it out. Ambulance is running on by. Thanks for checking it out. Always appreciate it when you watch our videos. Uh, if you've not hit that subscribe button below, please do so. Also get that bell notification button below. That'll notify you when we put up future videos. I'd love for you to hit the like button. It uh, helps us out immensely. Thanks for watching. Hopefully we can uh, give you some ideas of what to buy at Costco when you come out here on your vacation in Hawaii and have yourself a magical day.